Good morning everyone and welcome to a new video on the channel. It is Sunday the 5th of March 2023 and today it is my first ladies game since December. It is Redka Town versus South Shields in the North East Regional Women's League Premier Division. So Herman Redker and going into this game this afternoon, Redker Town are currently 7th in the North East Regional Women's League Premier Division. It is only a 10 team league but I've got to say I was uh, fairly impressed with them when I saw them against Leeds in the FA Cup. Just unfortunately uh, the game got a little bit away from them in the second half. Uh, as for South Shields they are currently in 2nd place, uh, I'm not sure how many uh, go up from this league but what I do know is it is highly unlikely that they are going to uh, win this league because above them is Chester Street Town who have won every single game this season whereas I think uh, South Shields have played 12 games uh, they've won 8 and lost 4 so uh, it shows that they are beatable uh, and if uh, Red Catown can uh, play to the strengths that we maybe saw against Leeds and uh, can sort of keep with it for 90 minutes then uh, there could potentially be some kind of result in this game for them today um, but we'll wait and see let's head on down to the Momola Memorial Park and find out how it all unfolds So the teams are warming up, uh, Red Catown getting ready just here of course going to be in their usual uh, blue and white striped home shirt this afternoon and so Shields are getting ready just there. The, of course, their traditional colours would be uh, claret and blue. Uh, it'll be interesting to see if that is what they're going to be in this afternoon, but we'll find out when the players are back out to start the match. So here come the teams, and uh, my prediction with what colour Shields would be wearing is correct, although maybe not as much blue as I was expecting. Anyway, let's go and win again. I'm um, underway. Still can't get it in. Oh! Goal 
half time record tone nil so shields won and i'd say it's probably fair that shields are winning on the balance of play i mean uh to be fair record tone they have uh competed quite well they uh, had uh, a few uh fairly decent ish chances of their own and uh, they're, they're still in the game i think uh, it's important in the second half that they at least don't let the game get away from them because they are going to have chances like of, of course they are like the, the way they they're going about it uh, they're, they're playing the long ball fairly well uh, so shields uh pressing a pretty high line so they, it's just about for a it's just about if they can sort of uh, getting behind that a little bit and uh, if they can get any uh, clear-cut chances uh, i mean as for shields uh, they've probably had the better of the chances and uh if anything like obviously the goal came as a result of a bit of a mix-up at the back and uh, there've there's been a couple of others where they've had the where the chances have been decent but they just haven't quite been put away but uh, it's still all to be decided in the second half then what a goal We all seem to do well up, mate. Yeah, they snatched a point in the last couple of seconds, didn't they? Train from Newcastle to London on that Saturday was sold out. Wizbetch, I think they've got a team. Oh. Oh, through. Hold on. That's him. Full time Red Catown one, so Shields three. Um I think Red Catown will be a little bit disappointed that they didn't get maybe at least a point out of that game because uh most of that second half, uh, they played very well. They had uh, control of the game, and uh, so Shields, uh, I've got to say, were really quiet up until the last few minutes. Uh, but then, obviously, your balls come in, uh, the goalkeeper's uh, flaps a bit, unfortunately, she's missed it, and uh, it's uh, gone into the back of net. And uh, from there, the Shields, to the credit, um, saw the game out. Sort of fairly well, just uh, took the sting out of it, then uh, added one more for good measure in, in injury time, um, but got to say, uh, once again, uh, impressed with Redcar Town, obviously another game where the, the, we're never going to be expected to win, and uh, unfortunately for them, uh, they have come out on the losing side once again, but um, overall, a good effort from them today and uh, as for Shields uh, it's it's uh, uh, three points on the board uh, turns out in this league it is uh, just the one that go up so uh, the chances of that are, are gone but uh, the look, looks as though they're going to go on and be uh, the best of the rest but that is that for this video and I'll be back tomorrow with the uh, monthly update video for the channel so until then take care cheers for watching and I'll see you later